because this is the way I have it. It's not very easy to record. These are my perfumes are on the first shelf. So in this little case right here um, are my rollerball perfumes. The spray needs to go. I try to do my perfumes and then my lotions and then my Bath and Body Works and Victoria's Secret lotions and sprays to the bottom. This video is going to be all over the place because there is no easy way for me to do this video. There just isn't an easy way. So, I'm going to go on the top shelf. And I'll probably just clean this off after the video because there's not going to be an easy way for me to do this. Um, I have my body creams on this shelf. And I have my body creams on here because I don't use them till the winter. Our summers are too hot here for a very thick body cream. So um, I kind of bought too many at one time. And hopefully none of them go to waste. But I really have to use these body creams up for the winter this year. Now that I'm back in Florida... The winters don't last as long and are not as cold. So I have some rollerball perfumes in here. All right, so as for my perfumes, I have Tory Burch. And if the lettering is too small, I'm not going to be able to tell y'all what it is. Just like heaven. I have YSL Black Opium. And I'm going to rearrange it off camera. Um, my favorite, which is the Juicy Couture Original. That's my favorite. I don't like any other, other juicies. Chanel Madame Moiselle. I have Dior Joy. Oh, I have a small flower bomb. I don't think flower bomb smells good on me. I won't be repurchasing that. I have a small Tiffany and Co. Intense. That's the one that's intense. I also have a rollerball of the Mademoiselle, the uh, Chanel Mademoiselle. I have Jador. I have a Chanel Mademoiselle um, body mist. Pull that down. Okay, I have Miss Dior. I have Miss Dior absolutely blooming. Almost out of Burberry Body. I really do love Burberry Body, so I'll be repurchasing that. I have a large bottle of the original Tiffany. Estee Lauder Modem Muse. Ow. Kate Spade. Walking on Air. This was very poorly made because that lid will not stay on there to save my life for that Kate Spade. I have to be very careful. Um, with that Kate Spade and then in my bond number nine I have this one which is Madison Avenue and if you look back there I also have the lotion for the bond number nine so that's it for my perfumes that are not roller balls so I need to get that get that together and organize that but that's it for my perfumes that are not roller balls and down to I was gonna you know what I'm just gonna pull all this stuff out and name it and then I'll put it back okay so what's already out on the floor is my forever red ultra sheer body free cream that's one of my favorites this is not going to be in any order because this is too much stuff this is my Victoria's Secret bombshell spray and this is bombshell seduction sorry I have the lavender and sandalwood body oil. I use the oils on my feet. I have Amber Romance and Victoria's Secret. The Bombshell Seduction body oil. Oh, my cocoa body oil needs to go back up here. Okay. Oops. I have Bombshell Intense. You guys know I love Bombshell, so you're going to see a lot of Bombshell. Victoria's Secret Coconut Twist. Um, Avon's Naked Love. This is really good, you guys. If you sell Avon, I know somebody that sells Avon. I have the spray here somewhere. Don't sleep. Don't sleep. I have the Bath and Body Works. I don't know how you say that, but that's what I have. It's a body oil. 
the pink urban bouquet i have to stop going on people's instagram and pages and buying stuff i bought this because somebody ranted and raved about it on instagram and i don't see what the big deal is okay this is my victoria's secret bombshell nights I haven't even opened this yet i'm gonna move some of the ones that i've opened to the front and try to use them up um i have the true blue spa uh super rich body cream This is some Gold Bond Ultimate uh, Coconut Oil. What is this? Just regular lotion. I probably need to use this up. This is Victoria's Secret, and these came out a long time ago. I don't know if y'all remember these. I don't know what the name of this one. It was a limited edition. Um, I need to use that up. I have the Rose Champagne. And you guys that have as much stuff as me, I'd love to know how you're using this stuff up bombshell nights in the spray because it's impossible forever red in the lotion but i think some of these lotions and sprays that are halfway i'm gonna have to do something um very sexy body by victoria okay we're getting somewhere another bombshell nights and i also have another one of these in the bathroom Ralph Lauren Romance Lotion. Pink Sunset. And there's like absolutely none of them that I want to sell or get rid of. So Forever Red Body Spray. So I don't know how I'm going to use all this crap. Coconut Passion Victoria's Secret. My favorite White Mocha Kiss Bath and Body Works. You're going to see some more of that. The Coconut Milk Body Oil. This Walking on Air by Kate Spade came with the perfume. Sweet and Flirty by Pink. I may have to give my daughter some. My daughter's coming to town. This is just a bag. I had got a Henry Bedell candle, and I like the bag. And then I also have some candles over here that I'm just um, not going to go through. All right, so that is the second shelf. And I should have showed you guys the body creams I have, but... This is a lot. Okay. Now, I'm going to scoot back and set the camera down so we can focus on the bottom shelf. Oh. Okay. Move all of these out of the way. Glad I didn't do this when my husband was home. On the bottom shelf. Passion Flower, Victoria's Secret, Bombshell Wildflowers Lotion, Black Raspberry Vanilla, Sensual Amber in the Spray, Velvet Sugar. This is a Shimmer Whip Body Cream. I probably wouldn't purchase that again. I have another Coconut Milk because these are done. This is, I think I have three of these. I don't know if they're going to bring them back, but they're done. Summer Marshmallow Beach Nights. Coconut Sunset. Another Summer Marshmallow Beach Nights. I did that on purpose because I don't know if they're bringing them back. Um, Almond Blossom. This is the Fenty Beauty Body Lava. I haven't even used that yet. Victoria's Secrets Angel. Bombshell Paradise. Fresh Sea Salt Mango. Um, this was an OPI lotion that my mom got from a lady who does her nails, and it's horrible. Thinking about putting that in the bathroom. In the stars. Wildberry chamomile with tea tree oil. Tucci Dolce. Boardwalk Marshmallow Clouds. Sunset Guava Culotta. And this is the Sandalwood Rose Stress Relief. Alright, so that's it for that. Now I gotta get over here. This is from Walmart. Smells really, really good. Coconut Oil Luxe Perfume. Smells really good. Um, Jungle Lily. Ooh. I'm tired. This is the Coconut Sunset... Um, spray this is the latest line that bath and 
not Bath and Body Works, Victoria's Secret came out with Candy Baby. This is a body oil from the Dollar Tree. All right, what is this? All a Dream in the pink line. Sugar High. And hopefully this video doesn't cut off because this is a lot of stuff. Um, cotton and lemonade. That smells really good, you guys. Watermelon lemonade. Beach Nights. You saw this in a lotion somewhere. Another Tutti Dolce. There's some that I double stocked up on. Um, I can't even get all the way back here. The one I just dropped was the In The Stars Spray. This is Winterberry Wonder. The Black Raspberry Vanilla Spray. I told you guys about the Avon Naked. This is the spray. This is another Forever Red Spray. Bare Vanilla Frosted by Victoria's Secret. Dude, True Blue Spa Lotion, another Forever Red by Victoria's Secret. What did I drop? Another Naked Avon Spray that I haven't even opened yet. And last but not least, I know you guys are waiting for this one, Black Cherry Blossom. Surprisingly, I only have one Black Cherry Blossom Spray. And then what was this? Almond Milk. Bath and Body Works. What? What is this? Face and Body Refresher Almond Milk. I didn't even know what I had. I gotta figure out what you're supposed to do with this. Is it a spray or an oil? I'm gonna have to see. Alright, and that is it. So, here is the contraption of what I have. And I'm gonna wipe the shelf down and try to put it back in a, in a decent order. I really want all my lotions on one side and all my sprays on the other side. So I'm going to try to do that and see how it goes. And maybe my oils or something there. But the only thing is the taller stuff has to go to the bottom. But I'm going to get ready to try to figure this out, wipe it out. And I'm going to put some of the lotions that are almost used up to the front and see what I can use up by the end of the year and some of the sprays. And then try to give some to my daughter who's coming to town soon. So... Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you guys have any suggestions of how to use this stuff up, please let me know because this is like lipsticks to me. You cannot, you can use the lotions up faster than the sprays. To me, no matter how much spray I spray, I never use up enough spray.